the Francis Scott Key Bridge, now a barrier for a key shipping lane. The Port of Baltimore is expected to be closed indefinitely as authorities investigate the collision that caused its collapse and work to clear the wreckage. It's critically important to our economy. Uh, it affects many, many jobs. It affects not only jobs here in Maryland, but around the country and, they, and world. Last year, the port processed over 52 million tons of foreign cargo worth some $80 billion. Each day it's shut down, a $217 million trade loss. And while Baltimore handles just 3% of container volume for the East and Gulf coasts, it's the top U.S. port for automobile imports and exports. Nearly 850,000 vehicles passed through last year. The port is also crucial for energy exports, shipping some 20 million tons of coal per year, most to India. It's a key lifeline for the local economy as well, accounting for more than 15,000 direct jobs and nearly 140,000 indirect jobs, generating $3.3 billion in personal income. We're looking at not having ships coming in for no one knows how long at this point. You know, and that's going to affect the lives of of longshoremen and stevedores and the tugboat crews. Some 40 ships remain stranded in Baltimore Harbor. Automakers like Ford, GM and Volkswagen say they will be rerouting their shipping to avoid major disruptions. The accident certain to have a massive impact on the regional supply chain and the local economy.